Solar System The solar system consists of the sun, eight planets and their satellites. Our solar system was born approximately 4.5 billion years ago from a thick cloud of interstellar gas and dust. It is made up of countless celestial bodies including planets, satellites, asteroids, comets and a giant star. The sun's family is referred to as the solar system. Our solar system is but a tiny portion of it. It is far larger than we can imagine. The sun is the largest and brightest star in the solar system. The electromagnetic energy that the sun emits in the form of heat and light make it a rich source. The moons are the natural occurring satellites of many planets in our solar system. Earth has one moon, the only planet in our solar system now to support life is Earth. It is packed with massive oceans and gases like oxygen and nitrogen that support life. There are definitely some parallels between Earth and Mars. Pluto was one of the nine planets in our solar system. When it first formed, it is currently referred to as a dwarf planet still. The Sun The only star in our solar system is the Sun. The other objects in our solar system orbit around it because it is stationary. It is the solar system's most massive element. The planets. The solar system consists of eight planets. These planets are Neptune, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, and Uranus. The planets are separated in two categories. Jovian planets and tertiary planets. Planets differ from one another in terms of size, mass, number of satellites and other geographical characteristics. There have been no indication of life discovered on any planets other than Earth. In comparison to outer planets, the inner planets are smaller and located closer to the Sun. The term terrestrial planets is the another name for this. The planets known as the outer planets are Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. These are called Jovian planets or giant planets because of their enormous size. First one is Mercury. Mercury is the smallest and closest planet in our solar system to the Sun. Low ridges and impact craters make up its geological features. Mercury has the highest daytime temperature since it is the planet nearest to the Sun. It is capable of reaching 450 degrees Celsius. It's shocking how cold the night are here. The diameter of Mercury is 4879 kilometers. There are no natural satellites for it. Second one is Venus. Venus is believed to be the hottest planet in our solar system. Atmospheric is poisonous and retain heat. It is also the brightest planet that can be seen with the naked eye. Its iron core is identical to Earth surrounded by a thick coating of silicate. On this planet, astronomers have observed signs of interior geological activity. Venus is 12,104 km in diameter. Similar to Mars, Venus lacks any naturally occurring satellite. Next one is Earth. 
Earth is the largest inner planet. Water covers two thirds of our world. In our solar system, it is the only planet where life is known to exist. Many different kinds of plants and animals can survive on Earth because of its rich nitrogen and oxygen content. But the atmosphere is being negatively impacted by human activity. The diameter of the Earth is 12,760 km. The Moon is its long natural satellite. Mars The term red planet is frequently used to describe Mars, the fourth planet from the Sun. This planet appears reddish because of the iron oxide that exists on it. The planet has been shown to contain traces of frozen ice caps. Mars have two naturally occurring satellites and a diameter of 6,779 km. Jupiter The largest planet in our solar system is Jupiter with an equatorial diameter of 88,846 miles. It is magnetically strongly charged. It is mostly made up of hydrogen and helium. It has band of clouds and a great red spot. It is thought that a massive storm across this area hundreds of years ago. Jupiter has 95 moons that have been officially recognized by 2023. Saturn Saturn is famous for its ring. Small pieces of rocks and ice make up these rings. Given that hydrogen and helium make up the majority of its atmosphere, it is quite similar to Jupiter's. Saturn is 1,20,536 km in diameter. It is consists primarily of ice and has 146 naturally occurring satellites. Next is Uranus. Uranus is the lightest of all the large outer planets and is located seven planets away from the Sun. Methane is present in the atmosphere. It has a blue spot. Compared to the other large planet, its core is cooler. Uranus has 28 naturally occurring satellites and a diameter of 50,724 km. Last one is Neptune. The final planet in our solar system is also coolest. With a similar mass to Uranus, it is far denser and more massive. Ammonia, methane, hydrogen and helium make up Neptune's atmosphere. Extremely strong winds are experienced there. This planet is the only one in our solar system that was discovered using mathematical forecasting. With 16 natural satellites, Neptune has a diameter of 49,528 km. Conclusion Approximately 99% of the solar system's mass is found in the Sun. For thousands of years, astronomers and scientists have been examining our solar system and their discoveries are fascinating. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and tap the bell icon to get new video updates.